So it seems we finally got some confirmation that Metal Gear Solid 4 will finally be playable on a platform other than the PlayStation 3. Now so many news outlets are reporting on this but I'm going to read the one from IGN which says Metal Gear Solid fans uncover additional evidence of possible Metal Gear Solid 4 remaster and more. Now back in June we got a leak that suggests that Metal Gear Solid 4, Walker and Metal Gear Solid 5 will all be included the part of the Master Collection Volume 2. And now, Reddit user Timo653 recently posted photos of code that were taken from the Metal Gear Solid Master Collection launcher. The string seemed to indicate that Metal Gear Solid 4, Peace Walker and even Metal Gear Solid 5 will be added at some point in the future. So that's very exciting but we also kind of knew that there was going to be a volume 2 of course because this one was named volume 1 and that volume 2 would most likely include Metal Gear Solid 4, perhaps Peace Walker and you might as well stick in Metal Gear Solid 5 too. However after the launch of the Master Collection volume 1 it's hard to get very excited for this because they are just ports and Konami didn't add any upscaling or any enhancements enhancements for the current gen consoles, they just straight up ported the game. And the PC version actually advertised outputting 1080p for Metal Gear Solid 2 and 3 which are currently being locked at 720p. And also IGN says that the Switch version meanwhile doesn't include all of the collection's games on the cart forcing players to download Metal Gear Solid 1, 2 and 3. So it seems like this was a quick job for Konami and they still haven't got it 100% right. You can play these PS1 and PS2 games on emulators and they run fantastically better. You can even get them upscaled to 4K. But honestly there is no excuse for Konami here. So looking forward to a Master Collection 2 where a game like Metal Gear Solid 4 which has previously been exclusive to PlayStation 3 is finally going to be coming to PlayStation 5. PC and Xbox series it is very exciting and I hope by the time this volume 2 comes out that they learnt from their mistakes from this collection. I feel like a game as big as Metal Gear Solid 4 which is no doubt going to be getting a remake sometime in the future that's a long way away right now does deserve its own kind of standalone release of a remaster version of the PS3's game. Metal Gear Solid 4, Peace Walker and Metal Gear Solid 5 should all have 4k options and although I think they're just going to be straight ports. I really hope this time around after the release of volume 1 Konami listens to the fans and add the suitable upgrades. Now I don't think Metal Gear Solid 4 Peace Walker and Metal Gear Solid 5 will be added to the volume 1 even though the references of this game are in the files of the launcher of Metal Gear Solid Collection volume 1. What I think is going to happen is that if you own volume 2 you'll be able to get access for those games via the Metal Gear Solid volume 1 launcher and by that time they'll probably even rename it to the Master Collection launcher. Now Volume 2 could be released this time next year or they could potentially give Metal Gear Solid 3 Remake the spotlight for 2024 and then release Volume 2 in 2025. And I think this will be more than enough time for them to add those 4K options and brand new features that they didn't add for the port of Metal Gear Solid Volume 1. However at this point anyway I think expect purely ports for the Metal Gear Solid Volume 2. And if they add the upgrades we could be pleasantly surprised. But you can now be 100% sure, take it to the bank, that Metal Gear Solid 4 will be freed of the PlayStation 3 and be available on PlayStation 5, Xbox Series, Nintendo Switch and PC. So I think this year alone has been an incredible year for Metal Gear Solid fans and I'm talking about all the updates in regard to the remakes of Metal Gear Solid and the remasters, what's to come for the future of Metal Gear Solid and the 2024 plans I've made a video on which I'll leave in the description and pin comment section below. So if you're a fan of Metal Gear Solid, Splinter Cell, Ghost Recon, all those types of stealth games, go ahead and subscribe to the channel and I hope to see you in one of my next videos. I'll leave links to my previous Metal Gear Solid videos and my stealth videos in the description and pin comment section below. We go over all the updates and I hope to see you in one of my next videos. Take care guys. I feel like I'm losing my mind Is everybody in the world blind? Please Lord give me a sign A sign I feel like I'm losing my mind